Agni's a little low on mana there. Hello, Agni. That's Ninja Ult. Alright. Welcome back, beautiful people. It's Saladin here, and today we're playing ranked as Mercury Jungle. Enemy spotted. Just looking for some poke. Maybe walk in on them, smack them a little bit, and use our one. And that'll be it. I don't think he has time to back, but he might. I have no idea why they didn't did let him back like this, but yeah, I guess. Didn't quite work. But they got the pressure, the early pressure on the clear, I guess, for that, so whatever works, works. Every little bit helps. Why is Scylla standing right next to the thing to actually do that? I, I don't know. We're definitely pressuring the left lane as soon as we can. It's uh, Kronos with beats and all that. We need to hit level 2 right here in the purple and then we immediately go for a gank. Good shit. Take the guy, you other purple. What are they doing, guys? Okay, we had to use a potion here. But we took some damage from the gank. But overall, good stuff. If they don't, they won't get caught here. This is gonna be a good advantage for them. Left mids might be going down right now. They're rotating there. Let's try if and steal those. Nope. Never mind. They might be going for the red. Enemy missing middle. Enemy missing middle. Be careful. Okay. Attack left lane. Attack left lane. White. 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 I'm on it. That's some beats. Nope. Never mind. Kronos is dead, good shit. But uh, yeah, Jingwei probably is dead too, yeah. Yeah, these boys are not paying attention. I like said to them attack and they decided to let me wait. And I knew that Neja was coming from behind so... We had no time to wait there, we should have engaged as soon as we could. They should pay attention to their buffs. That'll be great. Oh my god, he's not looking at him. We might get ulted here. We should fall back. Out. I don't want to get ulted by this guy. Let's drop this real quick. Did he just did what I think he did? Let's look at his speed. Damn it. It's down. Unfortunate. Hmm, this is bad. Let's look at their red buff, maybe. An enemy was annihilated. It's not up. Unfortunate we stuff. Be careful, left. 
Enemy missing. Had to save her. I'm dead. This Scylla just never used his ultimate. Not even once. That Scylla did not recognize the fact that the Neja set up himself for the Scylla ult. If I was him, I would have ulted immediately. Okay. Yeah. Unfortunate stuff, let's look at the dual lane. Maybe we can kill someone. Oh no. The oracles are up. An enemy has been slain. An ally will be remembered. Major should still be there. An ally spark has been extinguished. Awesome kill. That was not hard at all. We can back for a haste and katana and get our speed. Scylla's getting out farm. Her game participation so far is next to nothing. She's 0, zero, zero. Let's see what we can do about Agni here in mid. Maybe get his beads at least. Apparently he already dashed there, so yeah. He was panicking there, trying to... Just peel himself with the damage. Didn't really work for him. That's why you don't dash into the lane for no reason. Be right back. Be careful, right? I really need to help that Bill. She's in trouble. She's gonna get sashed, stopped, and chased down. They might invade the blue here. No, they're not looking for it. Enemy missing. Your right tower is under attack. Oh, hello, man. On my way. Ultimate is down. I'm in a bit of trouble here. That's a stun. I should get out. Should be able to. She should be able to finish him. This thing is up. And there's a good chance that speed is also up. He was backing. So yeah, this speed might be up. Ooh, sweet universe. There you go. Taking all the farm up here. Good shit. Going for right mids, maybe? Or is that too greedy? No, it's not. This Agni is out of position, actually. Be careful. Enemy missing. Enemy spotted. Yeah, Nisha is apparently frustrated. She's three levels below me. Be right back. Bye. She cannot ch get here soon enough with me having her speed. The best she can get there is the small camp for me. Agni's a little low on mana there. Hello, Agni. That's Ninja ult. That was nasty. Oh no, I'm dead to Sylvanas. Never mind. <laughs> that was a good bait. I really cannot join that fight. I did more than enough there. They apparently have a ward in mid, which I did not recognize in time, so I got almost got killed by a fucking support. That would have been nasty. Let's see, we can and definitely should invade uh, the enemy's speed since uh, Neja ulted and missed. So he's vulnerable. Yeah. Be careful, no. enemy it's missing. coming up right now. Right yeah, he's going the wrong way. It's gonna be down before he comes back here. Enemy missing. Enemy spotted. Completed. 
No, you must be fibbing. Oh, that did not hit. Good shit. Okay, I think I'm out here. On my way. I should be. My speed is coming up. Wait, that was wacky. Can we do something there? Okay. Cronus should be chased down here. Yeah, this is more important. She will chase him down, right? She will. I believe she will. Okay. Converting down really quick. I don't have crit though, but it's gonna take a while. Jingwei, however, does. Left mids just came up. We gotta stay. Actually, we're gonna invade the enemy speed again. Red just came down. Transition for right mids. Uh, yep, speed is coming up. Don't have eyes on Naja. There he is. Don't have bees or anything. That's his ult. He's vulnerable. Okay, that's too, a little bit too many people. Trying to get some farm. Got a little bit cocky there, tried to take the speed again. It's alright, it happens. We had to apply that pressure, we had the opportunity to do so, and yeah, I wanted to exploit it. He wasted so much time trying to secure that, and their whole team came to do that, so yeah. That was definitely worth it. He has Jodin, so his ult should be coming up real soon. I got some help, Halo. If Bologna helps me, I can take this down pretty easily. I don't think it's, it's worth it or anything. Oh, I was not there. Hey, hello, Sylvanas. You can kill him. No, never mind. Ardeo is also here. Everybody's here. Bologna is really big there. An enemy has been slain. Up a double kill. Good shit. No uh, Agni is also here. There's his dash. Need someone to tank it. There he goes. Does not need to take any damage, all he needs to do is just stand there and take it. Why would you leash it to me? Oh my god. He actually leashed it to me. I'm about to die. Damn it. That was close. Okay, we have a significant amount of sustain with the NFG, we can do the buffs and take the full Deathbringer here. That will be much more significant than just the tier 2 or like Rage. There we go. Let's see, who can we whoop here? That's a bad ult, if I haven't seen one. Let's open up the audio, I guess. She's like proxying the wave heart. 
Oh, I still crit him for more damage than he is gonna do me. That was nasty. Should really go on her. Good stuff. Minions are not coming, so I'm not gonna be able to push down this, unfortunately. Let's see whether the enemy speed is coming up, or I mean my second speed, more like. Oh, that's an ult. Let's delete this guy first, he's annoying. Oh, I'm tanking that. I don't want to do that. Oh, speed just came up. Let's take it. I don't think he cleared it before coming. Yep. Completed. Be right back. Attack right lane. End of line. Your right tower is under attack. Where are you going, babe? Be careful, lad. Retreat. Retreat left line. Retreat left line. Retreat. I'm on it. Oh, it's not coming up just yet. Can I do this actually? I think I can. Be right back. Be right back. Be careful. I had a shield from the Blood Force, so I thought I might do it. But it, even if I didn't, there was so much time. We gonna back and pick up a whole Wind Demon. And things are gonna get really ugly for the enemy team from now on. Where's my shit? Oh, that did not go well as I planned. <laughs> but damn, that lady shot just disappeared. That was funny. Yeah, Ardio is straight up just farming there. I don't think she can steal that. She does not have any resemblance of a burst. Oh, she took a tier one. Enemy spotted. Give me some kills. This tower is easy pickings even without minions really. The amount of damage I can dish out. Immortal. You're welcome. Just hit immortal. Let's see whether we can hit godlike here. Don't have bees to attack Naja though. Okay. 
Yeah, doesn't look like we're gonna get a god like this game, unfortunately. Hey, decent game of Mercury again. Not bad. Alright, so a quick summary of this game. Me as a Mercury, go into my typical build, nothing changes. Go into blink aggressively if I don't see a lot of CC on the enemy jungle and mid. It's always blink, then we still go into bees to allow us to escape when the late game we are constantly in danger of being blown up by two skills or something like this. Contrary to the Neja, goes into Jotun's, uh, into boots, into Deathbringer, into Titan's Bane. Quite typical season 2 build, but it's not how you build uh, in season 5, unfortunately for him. So I had all the pressure in the jungle, I took most of his speeds this game, I'm pretty sure had to rely on a four-man rotation to actually get a speed once and <laughs> that was really hilarious. Uh, Jingwei builds on point, three crits, uh, this is hopefully an execution to get some pin. Was doing decent in our lane, uh, I started to pressure this Kronos as soon as mm, second minus 30. Even before the minion clash I sent him to base by smacking him for half of his HP. And probably after that his mentality was not really on point. Uh, Kronos goes into Bancrofts, into Boots of Warlock Staff and Demonic Grip. This is probably a hasten ring. This is not how you build Kronos, so that also adds up. And the blink on the Kronos, like get the fuck out of here. Scylla in mid goes into Book of Thoth, Shoes of the Magi, Soul Gem, Divine, and uh, which is probably a Spear Megas. No, probably a Spear Deso actually. Yeah, doing fine, just like 18 kill participation out of 34. I have uh 20, 24 out of 34 well i'm just 10 kills short of participating in every single kill in the game so i got that going for me comparing that to enemy mid laner who's 3 7 and 2 he is actually participating in five kills out of 11 so it's almost a half quite decent <laughs> it's not he goes into bancroft into shoes of magi Cronus pendant and shoot spirit of the magus spirit of the magus should be third item no matter what you do he's lacking that penetration Going into early Kronos gave him nothing, except for the ability of me to kill him more effectively. Our Sobek in the support builds all right, I guess. Not spectacular, almost no support items and melee renewal. No, actually, this build is garbage. Don't build that, guys. This is not how you go about things. But yeah, blink on the Sobek as well. I don't even know what this guy was doing, but he has 15 kill participation overall, having died a lot. I applied a lot of pressure to his lane, so... He looks like he got carried hard there. Oh yeah, he was also really toxic in the lobby, so that's probably what happened. Look at this build. It's not a support build, it's a garbage build. And Shoes of the Magi is literally the only shoes you should never ever pick up on a support, so yeah. Comparing that to the enemy support, Talaria boots are bad, but are not my favorite, but they're not the worst kind. Definitely not this Shoes of the Magi level of bad. Lotus Crown into Hard Ward into what looks like maybe a Metal Discord. Overall at this point it doesn't matter, he was shut down so hard he has no ability to be impactful on anything. Even though he once even managed to almost kill me, my team was there to get them busy enough for me to get out. Our Bologna actually is the second player who helped me carry this game hard. Her gameplay was on point, she was 7-0 in her lane, she destroyed her lane, she started applying pressure elsewhere immediately and just me and her we were smacking everybody down, taking the objectives with her tanking the towers, the pyromancer, the gold furies, she was doing a hot job there. And yeah, it's really good to see a Bologna player like this. Comparing that to an Amy Ardio who literally went AFK in her lane and got what looks like 9 reports and hopefully gets banned forever, this is not even anything to compare it to. Let's look at the numbers now. Yeah, in terms of numbers, Bologna actually smacked more damage than I did, that's insane. Considering how many kills and kill participation I have, this is quite an achievement. Comparing that to the enemy in Asia, I'm 7k on top of him considering this game is 22 minutes, this is very very significant. Uh, Bell is uh, tripling the damage of the REO, Sobek is same damage as Sylvanas, uh, Scylla actually 7k on top of Agni, this and stuff all over, Jingwei 1.5k on top of that, Kronos was not doing very hot, nah, not acceptable. So yeah, me and Bellona and apparently Scylla was doing, were doing all the job there, so another game on the shoulders of my rank conquest and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, as always leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe to my channel, have a wonderful day, I will see you in the next video.